morning, everybody. Portside University Department of Commerce, Political Science Department, Dr. Ashraf Sanger, uh, Public Administration, uh, Session 3, Groups A, B, C, English Section. So, decision making uh, the administration of private organization and even a generous association require decision. In your life, you need decision. In your career, you need decision. And not one decision. In terms of uh, your life, you are making many decisions per day. So, you need many decisions that can really uh, help you to tackling all the issues in your company, in your university, in your work. Um, but making of a decision is not all. The implementation is the most important. So you can really uh, see the whole picture and that kind of bridge between uh, making decision and implement a decision. Revision, uh, to revise, and other aspects are also equally important. You cannot really stuck with one decision for your life, so you need to change uh, your decision in terms of changing you know, the events, uh, the structure of your institution. Uh, while the decision is going to be made, uh, the following procedures are strictly followed. You know. So you have to follow these kind of points and keep all that points you know, in your mind in your uh, final exam, if I like this topic to bring it in your final exam. One, the issue or area is identified on which the policy is to be made. So you need really to see, uh, you know, uh, your decision gonna to speak with someone. Uh, so you need really to identify your issue. The objective of the policy is decided. The policy maker decided for what purpose the policy is going to be made. Materials, number three, materials or means are to be collected for making a policy. Uh, you can't really make a policy without information, without materials, human resources, uh, knowledge. For it may be that all the means or materials couldn't be used, and then in that case, the decision maker selects only the relevant materials. And you're gonna to choose the best. Uh, uh, item, the, mets, the best materials can really fit for your uh, uh, point or your goal. Uh, decision making actually uh, in different fields, international relations, uh, public administration, public policy, uh, there are some models can really help us to understand decision making process. Belief system model. Some scholars are of opinion that in the arena of decision-making beliefs or ideologies like Iran for example they have like a system of belief ideology they are consistent with their ideology and that kind of ideology have a very important influence here groups of confusions um, decision maker irrational If the decision makers are rational, realism, we assume state and leaders they are rational. It will be supposed that they are not to be influenced by beliefs. هم عقلانيين مش بيتبعوا بس فكرة المبدأ والعقيدة بيدور على what is the best outcome and ideology خلاص ممكن يطلع برا الايدولوجي او البليف عشان يخطر القرار الصح but this argument doesn't stand the test of reality في الحقيقة مش كل الناس تفعل بس مش كل الناس بتتبعنا في صنع القرار ساعات العقيدة والبليف برضه بسيطة 
have the belief of uh, of the belief or attachment to ideology as uh, perceived uh, or formed uh, the decision maker may temporarily give priority to ideology or belief and stuck with their belief and ideology stages of decision making the decision making can be divided into several stages. For example, uh, we need to know more about, you know, <clears throat> this kind of stage. Uh, you know, emerging the problem. Uh, problem has a, a reason. And in order to go up with it, it is the decision is to be adopted. We have to find like coronavirus now. Uh, President Sisi, he made many decisions last two weeks to adopt uh, a policy to really achieve Egypt's goal in dealing with this uh, virus. Uh, again, the problem is not to be allowed to be aggregated. Aggravate. Taking a decision is not all. It is to be properly formulated. Be it gahiz is the Then the issue of implementation, and evaluation or taqi. Researchers have divided all these into four different categories, which are policy initiation, policy formulation, policy implementation, and policy evaluation. I think this is very simple English. Policy initiation is the crucial stage of decision making. A policy is initiated generally in the background for problems or critical issues, number of factors play an important role in that in the initiation of decisions. Some of them are stated briefly. This is your uh, in future when you really be part of uh, uh, your uh, institution, your career, your company, your organization. You need really to brief about the issue. Scholars, writers, and academics, Zayena, are very important factors. factors These persons are not directly associated with political activities. أحزاب سياسية موجود في عملية صنع قرار في كايرو ولا في الجوفرمنت فاحنا we just give some يعني perspectives on government but their writing and opinion initiate the decision making process كتاباتنا بقى بتبدأ تجهز المفترض ان صانع القرار ياخد هذا القرار formulation of decisions once it has been decided that to go with the situation or a problem, decision is to be prepared. Policy maker then proceed to adopt a decision. And this is called policy decision formulation. Which is the second stage, of course, initiation policy, formulation policy or decision. The formulation of policy may aim either at short-term or long-term objectives. Whatever to be the case, the formulation must proceed taking into consideration of the nature of the objectives. It has been found that the nature of policy depends on the attitudes, outlook, and belief of the person who provide the leadership in the formulation. 
like Trump in the White House, you know. So some of the, uh, you know, uh, people around Trump, the inner circle, they provide the president kind of, you know, like um, attitudes or belief or outlook. What is really next for the US centrist, for example? Third, implementation of policy. This is so cool. <laughs> you need really to implement, you know, initiate a decision, formulate a decision, but you need really to make sure that you can really implement this decision because if you fail to implement all of these guys, you know, all of these items is already you know, nonsense. Implementation of decision in the third stage of policy and conventional analysis. Uh, this kind of, you know, uh, implementation of, poli of policy, uh, it's really crucial and important. The political leaders or the government formulate decision and then it, it is left for the bureaucrats. And this is the crucial. If the President CC initiate the decision and formulate the decisions, to the Minister of Foreign Affairs, Luzart al The bureaucrats, the diplomats, they are responsible to execute this kind of policy and implement this policy. If they will train, so the decision will be uh, nice. If they will know, the decision will be good. But if they failed as a bureaucrat to implement, bye-bye. So this is mean that you, know, you failed in every uh, things outside or before this stage. So the recent analysis in that kind of, you know, uh, uh, process, uh, we need really to understand, you know, once a decision has been implemented, the formulators will have to study the impact, of the decision, الامبلمنتيشن لها تأثير على القرار نفسه هل هو is good or bad يعني ممكن تعمل for يعني equation ان انت to check the quality of decision by what? by implementing the decision has been implemented and for, for uh, formulators as I mentioned impact the decision this is necessary because of what? because of the reason if the policy fails to reach the goal we should really revise it, the revisions or reformulations or reformulate will be required. لازم نغير ولازم نعدل القرار كله زي ما انتوا درستوا كده في الحاجات اللي هي traditional or primitive stage inputs, outputs. If outputs is not really uh, uh, catching your goal, you have to change the inputs. Uh, last slides for today for the subject and read it carefully and expect an, a questions is coming soon in uh, on your WhatsApp uh, groups as you know guys you have a group for male group for female which includes uh, group A B C the final stage of the decision making process is the evaluation تقييم السياسة أو تقييم القرار في policy makers or the authority لهم إحنا elected already them اخترناهم بالانتخابات اتفقنا على السياسيين المسؤولين على ميسر القرار so after the implementation sets to ponder over the pro and cons العيوب والمميزات مقارنة مع of the policy the chief objective, al of is to study the success and failure of the policy. I see the success and failure of the policy. The stage is very important for your life. When you think about your life, you have to study this and read this very carefully. Uh, thank you so much for today. Uh, read it carefully. And again, I'm warning all names, Drus, Marekz al Khususiya, Wikambura B, Farawla Hanim, and I'm going to ask you if there's another one in the list.
حد اسمه حنان او حاجه زي كده الاسماء عماله تجيلي من طبعا مصادر المعلومات المتعلقه بالمراكز والسناتر خليكم في شغلكم ما تقوموش بشغل حاجه انتم مش متخصصين فيها ما تضحكوش على الطلاب ما تضحكوش على طلبه الكليه وتقنعوهم ان انتم يعني عندكم الحل السحري في تنجحوهم وان انتوا لكم اتصالات بناس في الكليه سواء كانوا موظفين او دكاتره الكلام ده في منتهى الخطوره والطلبه باوراقهم ومكاتباتهم وكلامكم متسجل وبدا يوصل لنا ايفيدنس وادله كتيره جدا انا حابب بس في نهايه البرزنتيشن اقول لكم الكلام ده طبعا الكلام ده مهم لمستقبلك في مدرستك او في مكان عملك او اذا كنتش بتشتغل هتسال وهتتعرض الى متابعه رقابيه من الاجهزه السياديه في كل تجاوزاتك ان انت بتفتح مراكز دروس خصوصيه داخل حرم خارج حرم الجامعه وده امر ما ينفعش مدرسين في اعدادي او بيدرسوا في ابتدائي او حتى ثانوي يخشوا في ده 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 اتس نان اوف يور بزنس ده مهم قوي ان انتوا ما تضحكوش على الطلاب وتوهموهم الطلبه لازم تبدا تشتغل تشتغل من الكتب الجامعيه المقرره اللي احنا حددناها لهم فالموضوع ده موضوع مهم ان انتوا تاخدوه في الاعتبار ولا الضرر سيكون شديد والتعويض سيكون شديدا ايضا في حاجه اسمها البروبرتي رايتس حقوق الملكيه الفكريه للباوربوينتس للكتاب للمحاضره وانتوا طبعا كنتوا بتشغلوا ناس وتضحكوا على طلبه يسجلوا للدكاتره عشان تقدروا تعملوا الشو وتشغلوا ناس وتدوهم بعض المقابل او اشياء معنى الكلام مهم قوي في الموضوع ده فبي كيرفول لطلابي لو انت موجود مع الناس ديت جيت ريد اوف ذيم سون It's really dangerous to stay with them. لو انت فضلت على ان تواصل مع المراكز والدروس الخصوصية والمدرسين ستكون في خطر شديد ولا تلومنا الى نفسك اذا انت رصبت وعدت سنة او فشلت فده بسبب ان انت ما تسمعش كلام البروفيسور بتاعك او تسمع كلام العميد او سياسة الكلية او ادارة الكلية او ادارة الجامعة او وزارة التعليم العالي فهي رومرز اشاعات بتطلع والطلبه اللي تقعد بعتها واحنا هننجح واحنا كده خلاص بطلنا دراسه لا تاني وزير التعليم العالي قال كلام مهم جدا في هذا الشعر مجلس الجامعه قال كلام مهم في هذا الشعر مجلس الكليه قال كلام مهم في هذا الشعر مفيش طالب هيتخرج الا لما يقعد في الامتحان مش هطلعك انا محاسب تروح بنك تشتغل تفضحنا ما لا اصل انا معلش بقى الموضوع ده انا ما درستوش لان كان في كورونا فايروس وما درسناش ونجحونا. او مهندس ما يكملش الماده العلميه بتاعته في الديزاين او في التصميم. يرجع بقى يوقع لي عماره ولا دكتور ما ياخدش الماده العلميه قبل ما يتخرج يروح يموت لنا في عيني. ديت امور تعليم عالي اتس هاير اديوكيشن وطبعا احنا بنتبع سياسه الدوله ونشوف التعليمات جايه من القاهره ومن وزاره التعليم العالي ومن رئاسه الجامعه ومن عامات الكليه فبليز ما ما تحاولوش تمشوا ورا الاشاعات ستي ات هوم ريد كيرفولي ستادي كيرفولي فولو مي اون ذا سكول يوتيوب الجامعه الكليه لها موقع على اليوتيوب وانا شايف النهارده في البرزنتيشن اللي فاتت اكتر من 1400 طالب شاهدوا الباوربوينت برزنتيشن بتاعتي على اليوتيوب في تجاره انجلش يعني ممكن بعض الطلبه تجاوزت الرقم 400 لان ممكن بعض الطلبه شافت البرزنتيشن مره او اثنين او ثلاثه او بعض الناس دخلوا يتفرجوا على البرزنتيشن دي من مصادر ثانيه انا بنشكر طبعا دكتور احمد عبد الرحمن نشكر اداره الاي تي الدكتوره منى آه طبعا آه سامي منى سامي طبعا آه دكتوره فاضله بتساعدنا في رفع الماده العلميه دكتوره نيفين آه يعني الفريق نيفين المر الفريق اللي الدكتور احمد آه جهزه للاي تي عشان نقدر نتواصل مع الطلاب ونقدر يعني نبقى دايما ان انا عارف ان دي مهمه صعبه آه 
الاونلاين طبعا عمليه قاسيه جدا ان انتوا تقدروا تحصلوا غير طبعا الكلاس فيس تو فيس ولكن انتوا كتجار انجليزي المفروض ان انتوا بتطوروا اللغه عشان تقدروا يعني ان انتوا تو ادابت يور سيلف فور يور فيوتشر انت لو ما قدرتش تفهم الانجليش ده وما قدرتش وانا النهارده يعني بعد الريكومنديشن يعني العميد طلب مني قال لي طيب برضو روح حاول نحط بعض الكلمات بالعربي ايفن اي هيت ات ان انا طبعا يعني ان انا اعمل برزنتيشن ان انجلش ان عربيك ات ذا سيم تايم ذيس سو ديفيكولت ولكن ام تراينج ام دوينج ماي بيست ان انا برضو في بعض الاكسبريشنز او الكونسبتس بحاول اعمل الترجمه دي جود لك انجوي ذا ريست اوف ذا داي Thank you so much uh, for all of you, and thank you for your cooperation. And I'm very happy. I'm very glad. El, uh, replying, يعني, uh, awesome. I, I'm, I'm very, very, very happy. Uh, طبعا, still some students uh, they don't care. وأنا برضو بقول لهم جملة I don't care. يعني I have to learn to smart enough to understand, صح? فإن أنت لو مش مهتم, أنا مش مهتم. So don't ask me about your uh, final grade if you failed or you just pass was pass. مقبول يعني. مقبول ده حاجة ما تنفعش لطالفة جارة انجليزي. فبي كيرفول. و... وانا مش عايز كل مرة at the extension ده. ولكن النهاردة عشان محاضرة very short شوية. فانا حبيت ان انا يعني اديكو كده an extension to listen careful instructions بتاعتي. خصوصا السناتر اللي بره المدرسين اللي بره وحضراتكم اللي يعني مندهش بنسبه الخداع العاليه في طلاب زيكم كده المفروض ان هم متحملين مسؤوليه وان هم يعني مفترض ان هم يعني بيفهموا ف اي هوب ان انتم تكونوا سمارت انف عشان تقدروا يعني تكملوا بشكل كويس في الكليه الموضوع مش بيكي ماوس مش فراوله هانم ولا كمبوره بي اللي هيبدا يحدد لكم مستقبلكم والتعليمي في الكليه ماشي ازاي انف از انف ثانك يو باي